how did it feel to be made captain of this club job? I mean, you know, it's, I think you know, I'm so proud to be representing the club, um, and then to be to be given the privilege of, of wearing the armband and, and leading the lads out. Yeah, it's absolutely it's uh, it's an honour. And I, like I say, I just hope I can make the uh, the club and the fans proud and. Hopefully we can have a, a successful season. Yeah. And what about yourself personally, Joe? Have you been pleased with your your displays? I think you've won our August Player of the Month award. Have, have you been pleased with how you've adapted to life at, at York City? Um, I, I, look, I, I absolutely love playing for York City. Um, you know, the, the lads are spot on. Um, obviously, with, without making excuses, I think we're you know we're not having a pre-season. I'm I'm still probably playing a uh, catch-up, but yeah, I think you know I think I think we look solid. Um, it's a joy to play alongside you know Hamza and Griffey. Um, and you know, then boys in midfield and up top and whatnot, we've, we've got a cracking squad. So, um, you know, if, it, if I can add a bit of value on and off the pitch, then absolutely brilliant. And how have you found the caretaker manager style of play at the moment? Have you have you brought the ball out, out from them full back positions at <laughs> previous clubs? Or? I think it's you know, I, I, you know, it's, it's, it's a bit different to what to what uh, I've been used to, but you know, he installs that confidence in you where you know, he says, listen, go and play, you, you, you're all good players, go and play. Um, and I think you know, even at times today, I think. Uh, I think it showed that you know we're, we're embracing um, what he's trying to implement here, um, and you know they made it really difficult for us. They suppressed high at the pitch and they made it hard for us to get out. But um, I think the message is just just be brave and go and express yourselves because we've got some real good players in there. Yeah. Um, and you know even like me and Hamza, you know we're comfortable on the ball. Let's go and play, and make things happen. And uh, I think the longer he's in charge, I think you know the, the better we're going to get. Yeah. And how does it feel to be missing a weekend on quite unusual circumstances? <laughs> just had a conversation again. Yeah, I think um, I think you know the last thing we want to do is be missing the game. But you know we won't be making excuses. Um, <laughs> I've heard a little whisper that it's going to be really tough next week, um, which is which is absolutely you know so it should be. Um, so, listen, we can only we 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 can only play. Um, you know, we've got no control over international fixtures and whatnot. Yeah. You know, we need to be ready. Come, I think it's Kidderminster, yeah. uh, two weeks Saturday, and uh, uh, believe me, believe you and me, we will be. Yeah. Do you think it'll help yourself, Joe? I've mentioned that you missed pre-season in terms of getting that fitness right. I think it probably week. will. Yeah. yeah, I think it. I think it will help me. Yeah, I think um, I look after myself off the pitch. Um, but yeah, maybe getting a few double days in and whatnot. I think yeah, it, it, it could help me. Yeah. Again, you know, you get the more games you play, the more match fit you get. Yeah. And you know, in an ideal world, we'd probably like the game next week because you know, I know we drew today, but we're in a decent run of form. Um, but yeah, you know, let's work hard next week and make sure we're ready. Come Kidderminster at home on whatever the date is, two yeah. weeks time. Yeah.